Hello sir, can you please explain that SO20022? Financial industries across different geographies and business areas have used different standards to exchange information with their customers and among themselves. Some of these standards include ISO 15022, ISO 8583, FIX, FPML, SWIFT, XPRL, and several proprietary domestic standards. With globalization and the ever-increasing need for end-to-end -end processing, there has been a need for an international standard that allows the sender and receiver of a message to have a common understanding of the structure of the message, syntax, and its meaning, semantics. ISO 20022 has been developed and maintained as a standard which cuts across domains and geographies to contain risk, reduce cost, and deliver effective products and solutions, despite all of the intricacies of business processes and transaction types. What would the advantages of ISO 20022 be? One, unique standard for communication. The ISO 20022 dictionary provides concise definitions for common business concepts, thus promotes common understanding across geographical and business domains. These definitions can also help shape or define internal communication needs. Example for the credit transfer, the definitions would include a debtor, the party that pays, creditor, the money receiver, debtor agent, the bank of the debtor, creditor agent, the bank of the creditor, and lastly the payment. Two. Risk Reduction The schema provides a high level of business validation, reducing the risk of sending or receiving incorrect data. 3. Cost Reduction ISO 20022 messages are free for anyone to implement on any network. 4. Interoperability ISO 20022 works with other standard bodies to promote interoperability. For example, its presentation of data using the universal markup language, XML and others, allows for modern computer software to read and manipulate the data. 5. Maintenance It allows users to shape the development of messages they rely on. 6. Ease ISO 20022 definitions are collaboratively created by industry experts from around the world to ensure their completeness and accuracy. This process is open to anyone in the industry willing to participate. Moreover, the dictionary can be easily explored using its web query tool with no special software needed. Is there a methodology for this standard? The methodology of this standard is based on the concept of three separate layers. A. Business process. It defines the business roles and actors involved in that activity, and the business information needed for the activity to take place. Examples discussed earlier for the credit transfer. B. A logical message describes all the information that is needed to perform specific business activity, independent of syntax. It is derived from the business component and organized in a hierarchical structure. C. The syntax layer is the physical representation of the logical message. Often it is written with XML or ASN.1. However, a particular business domain may adopt a different syntax. In our next video, we would be dealing with ISO 20022 in practice and the opportunities. Thank you for listening. We hope you gained something from this video. Press the like button if you did drop comments, and feel free to subscribe to our channel for short and succinct trends, aspirations, and opportunities in tech.